Often people think the terms are synonymous, uh, or some people do. Uh, I would suggest that funding is a subset of liquidity. Maintaining liquidity by definition means maintaining funding. But liquidity is a wider set. So if I was doing a fund diagram, I'd put funding entirely within the, 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 the universe of liquidity. Funding is a point in time concept. Liquidity characteristics of an asset or liability also take into account term and marketability considerations. Um, a portfolio of Teddy mortgages can be funded by either one month into bank deposits or the proceeds of a long term senior debt issuance. Obviously, one is cheaper than the other. But the shorter the term of the funding, in other words, the longer the gap, the mismatch in tenor in, in lifetime between the asset, between the loan and the deposit, the asset and the ability, means the greater liquidity risk one is running. Okay, so and liquidity is also is also spoken in terms of market liquidity. How liquid is an asset? How long will it take me to generate liquidity? I can have liquidity, for example, cash at the bank, or I can have an asset that can be turned into cash. How liquid is that asset? That's market liquidity, trading liquidity, secondary market liquidity. So there is funding, and then there is also the market liquidity point that I've made about how quickly can I turn something into cash, into instantly accessible cash, instant accessible liquidity.